Welcome to Good Morning Central Oregon. This is very exciting. We have Shereen Gastineau here. She is a visual artist. She has brought us an amazing assortment of things. She's already going to get started painting. Um, but you are here. We're talking um, all of the different types of artwork that you can oh. create and that you're really into painting right now. But why don't you tell me, Shereen, yeah. what all of this as well are you, do you have on display? I have watercolor and I have my photo art, which is made from photography. Those are layers of my images that I used. Fantastic. Yeah, so it, it, I try to make it to where it actually looks like painting, but it's photography. I would say so, for sure. Now you may know of Shireen because of um, all of the experience you have with the Dry Canyon Arts Association. I That's in Redmond. I love to do <laughs> massive amount of uh, showings. We do First Friday art walks in Redmond mostly and looking forward to getting into Bend. Yes, which of course, it being First Friday Art Walk, very exciting. This is amazing to me that I'm here I am. <laughs> <laughs> Wondering if I should be doing something because you're over here creating some beautiful now, art. I'm just goofing around. You Tell know, me all I, about it. I love to just get get fun with it, throw things down. I've put a bunch of colors together to blend. And last night I came up with a little um, surprise thing we were going to do. We'll show in a second. But yeah. we'll, we'll get more into this later. Well, it doesn't look like it's going to do anything, but that's salt, some alcohol. I'd say so. Onto there and it will actually turn into a landscape. So, wow. Okay, so this is, this Magnificent. is kind of what that started out with to begin with, but now we are going to. Now you, uh, this is watercolor. Watercolor. You've got some water up here, you have brushes and some paint. I am. And then you added some salt to add some texture. There you are with that water again. I, I was a little bit more elaborate last night, obviously, but <laughs> I was doing this at home without struggling to, to think it through. But what we're doing is just letting the watercolor do its own thing. We're going to get plenty of this yellow in here, drip it down, and we're creating mountains right now. That's what we're doing. Where do you come up with the idea to begin? Ooh, that is neat. Right? We're getting some colors to blend and do their thing, and happy accidents, basically. Happy accidents. <laughs> <laughs> you must have gotten some inspiration for that one. <laughs> wow. So you could, you know, it tells you what it wants to do sometimes. You know, you kind of send it in one direction and it does another. Now, if you don't know even where to begin, you really are saying that if you just start, something might be created. It, uh, completely. <laughs> and you have so much fun. And I wanted to and, and just like let everybody know that art can be so therapeutic. If you're working through tough times, um, it can kind of help you to facilitate getting through the tough times. Because it, other than being on TV, it's very relaxing. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're making wanted, this look really easy. <laughs> I want to let you know that this is how I envisioned it and... From beginning and middle and to a finished product. I mean... <laughs> As it runs everywhere, but uh, yeah. What other supplies do you like to use when you're creating art? I go crazy with texture and details, right? So that's where you want to give some extra interest by um, just, ooh. And here, this is how I got my mountains, okay? Is that a card that you I cut? cut I cut up a, a credit card deal or my old library card, sorry. <laughs> you got a new one. <laughs> it's a new year. So, <laughs> anywho, yeah, I, I uh, work with things like that. Yes. And, and get some supplies in the house. Get creative texture. I use Brillo pads. You know what I mean? Sticks. I go hiking. I grab a stick. Um, I've had a, a bone. I mean, like, I have a little collection. And, like, okay, I think this needs a little extra oomph to it. Something. Yeah. And Where do you pull, pull inspiration for some of your art that's here on display? Okay, so this one right here. here. This out of the way for now. So this, the, Oh, no, it's this one. This Sorry. face <laughs> on the watercolor right here. That just, I just like to be something at unusual, and that's representative of us as humans. We're not perfect, but we're still lovely. I need some paper right? towels. Oh, they, we, we really <laughs> cut it in. I this was prepared really, for the mess. This is really lovely. And this is something that you've had on display at First Friday Art Walks. Yes, and it won a prize at the uh, fair this year. Did it really? Yeah, everything placed um, of mine that I put in. That was fun. That is fun. And then that sold immediately, the, the original sold immediately, and its sister, um, companion to that. Fantastic. Yeah. Okay, how about this one? Then I'll put this back up front. I show so many different things, and that's one thing I need to narrow down is that I'm all over the place. <laughs> I love to do so many different things. I think that's a good way to be, actually. Yeah. 
whatever kind Not of boring. Art. No, <laughs> and, and I think it gives folks inspiration that you know you don't have to know exactly where you're headed if you're interested in doing some arts and crafts. Just try, you may fail, but or you may come up with something fantastic yeah. that an original piece sells, and then you win all these awards at the fair. <laughs> you know, have fun in the meantime. <laughs> That's yeah. right. Well, Shireen, we are sure thankful that you came in to show us such a very quick watercolor painting. That was impressive speed. Um, and you taught us some really <laughs> neat tricks with salt and with a sprayer. Yeah, I hear I'm thinking. My secret re re uh, ingredient. Yes. Secret ingredient, yeah. adding some texture to salt because it kind of dissolves and it makes a new it, it, piece of art. It does these little bits. Really, really neat. Okay, first Friday Art Walk's happening tonight in Redmond. Um, you'll definitely be, be able to. Yes, Shireen will be at the next one. But if you did want to catch some of Shireen, artwork uh, where can people go to find what you're up to I am photoartist.com photoartist.com I am photoartist oh I am mm. don't forget that part that's key <laughs> <laughs> okay Shireen thank you so much thank for being you. here I appreciate and we'll it. be right back after this